And of course, you find it in humans. That behavior in us is associated with the emotions that we label with things like guilt, anger, sympathy, gratitude, and so on. The question of whether other animals uh, have those same emotions, I agree, can't be answered just by observation. But if you look at the evidence as to whether there are enough points of similarity, enough homology, enough evidence for homology, then I think one can make a sensible argument. For example, are there the same um, hormonal states when a human feels guilty and when an animal does something that one might be tempted to call guilt? Are there the same facial expressions? Do the same parts of the brain light up? I don't know what the answers to these questions are, but I think it is a, a studyable problem. So finally, do you think, uh, are we free to override biology? Well, we're free to override a lot of biology except for being born and dying and eating and going to the bathroom and sleeping. I think we have to stick with those, though, no matter what. But all the in-between bits? I think so, yes. Free in what sense, Stephen Pinker? Well, my question is, who's we? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I th certainly, one part of us can override most other parts, but that part of us, the decision maker, the, uh, the, the little man in control in the head, is it itself a part of our biology. So I'd say one part of our biology can overcome another, but I'm uncomfortable with the idea of the free-floating uh, me hovering above the brain somehow, uh, pulling the levers of behavior. Well, I think the fact that in the long run we're all dead tells us that we're not free to overcome the constraints of biology, but we know that, and I think we'll just have to accept it and make sure that biology doesn't uh, rule what left we have of our lives. And Jonathan Miller. Well, I'm holding in my hand an example of overriding biology. We're sitting around an example of one, and I'm looking at my wrist, which is an example of overriding biology. In that sense, we have overridden it in the ways which we find interesting about ourselves. I'm wearing an overriding of biology. Well, and I'm looking at an overriding of biology, <laughs> and I'm afraid we're out of time. And my thanks to Stephen Pinker, Steve Jones, Meredith Small, and Jonathan Miller. Good night. Thank you.